day news on Prince Amila Entertainment TV. Today is the 11th of November uh, 2022. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow. And so guys, here's the latest news. Uh, municipalities in Arare province have been ordered to provide material and human resources amounting to tens of thousands in US dollars for President Emerson Nangagwa's R45 presidential cleanup campaign, which starts at Thursday. The directive was given by Provincial Development Coordinator PDC Tafazwa Muguti. The operation which will target those illegally occupying or engaging in businesses on wetlands as well as sand, poachers and brick mortars, residential waste and emissions in Harare, Shitungwiza, Rua, Epworth Council's ends on December 15, already reeling from low revenue streams and failure to provide expected services in their jurisdiction councils we each have to provide 80 municipal officers 10 tipper trucks three front aid loaders five compactors fuel lunch and refreshments for all personnel in the operation according uh, to H. Tungwiza municipality the operation is in response to Mnangagwa concerned on increased environment related crimes within the metropolitan province the report seeks to bring to councillors' attention the impending 45-day presidential cleanup campaign code named Operation Zero Tolerance to Environmental Crimes, commencing on the 10th of November to 15th of December 2022 in Arare Province. This report signed by Shitungisa Town Clerk Evangelista Machona. This follows high-level meetings held on the 7th and 8th of November 2022 at Zimbabwe Investment Agency House and Rainbow. Uh, towers respectively. The operation is a response to the concerns raised by the Presidium over increased environmental crimes in Arare province. Additional manpower will be deployed from ZRP, 50 officers, Environmental Management Agency, EMA, Ministry of Local Government, Office of the President and Cabinet and Vehicle Inspectorate Department, VID. The operation will be headed by the Director, Local Governance and deputized by Zimbabwe, the Public Police, Chief Superintendent Operation, Chief Security Officers from the four councils and desk officers from the Ministry of Local Government. Roles meant for Central Intelligence Organization CIO operatives are not specified in the document. As if Chitungiza Municipality could afford supporting the initiative, Spokesperson Lavmo Mayor said they were in a position to do so. Chitung is adopted this and is fully supporting the program. We ensure maximum support in terms of resources, said Mayor. Another council spokesperson, Isan Ruende, was not in a position to answer, referring all the questions to Muguti. Chitung is a residence trust director, Alice Kovea, said they were not in support of the operation and wanted their council's top brass to be fired and replaced by people residing in the dormitory town who understand better issues affecting them. Kuvea questioned how council could be able to finance part of the operation when it has gone for months without paying salaries. There is no coordination between councillors and management for which the whole management gets fired and replaced by people from Shutungiza who understand our problems better, said Kuvea. This is rubbish so they can afford fuel and lunches for people to demolish but they cannot pay workers, collect garbage or fix our sewer system. Kuvea said Chitungiza Council had no right to demolish anything as it had recently forced residents on the same spaces to pay 2000 US dollars as part of its regularization process. The four councils have been ordered to take ownership of all sand abstraction and brick molding sites and put bins every 80 meters. Emma has been ordered to collect refuse and garnish the cost from the four councils. All construction on wetlands will be demolished as to restore them to their original state. And so that's the latest year. I seems like uh, starting um, November 15 up to December 15, Shitungu uh, Zaroa, Harare, is Rachange Vachi, Pinda Mudumbo Zagasiana Siana, Vachi Demolisha, Zimba Zagawa on wetlands. And due to my land barons, when things are mustangs, you sit from Temu, when you go things are mustangs because the open space, you don't want to open. So we're going to see a lot of um, houses being demolished at the same time. I'm a business is an operator and like what I was going to say, 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 
is I don't know the Mapurisa and the council and the Gasaga. Many people are surviving through that. I mean, uh, I don't know in Zimbabwe, Wajinji, or Kukia Kia, Dokia Kia Kwajo, Hasla, but at the same time, I uh, remember with Iowa, Akuna Jagadaro, you guys, Mukanga Nisa environment. And uh, so, we'll be keeping you guys here up to date with the latest here on uh, daily news, breaking news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Mm-hmm.